Hi, we're into 2019 and we've all become more health conscious. So today we're going to look at why it is so important we keep hydrated and keep drinking more water. Hi, and if you're new here, I'm Jamie Brown, the Hedge Teacher. This channel is about sharing information to help build your financial intelligence and your awareness around money matters. I am passionate about educating and inspiring people in health and wellness. You see, to be whole, we need our health with our wealth. There's a new type of money master in the world today. Times have changed. You have to get onto the same page. There's a new way of thinking, of being, and of understanding. Join me on this adventure now. Hey, why should you drink more water? Are you getting enough to stay healthy? Most of us have a, a busy lifestyle, but do we do the basics right, like drinking enough water to keep us healthy all year round? Many people, in fact most of us, have a hard time drinking enough water throughout the day. It's one of those things we're supposed to do. We know it benefits us, but we get caught up in life and, it's, and all the challenges that come with it. We also know it's important to drink water for our body especially our minds, and the amount we need to consume every day plays such a huge role in our well-being and maintaining a healthy lifestyle. Water is known as the elixir of life. Every part of our body needs it to, to survive. It's no secret that the body is made up of approximately 60% water, and in any given day, your body will lose around 64 ounces of water through perspiration. 16 ounces of that is lost from your feet alone. Are you in tune? Those of us who partake in exercise are usually a bit more in tune with our body's needs and are more aware of how much perspiring we do during these times. But for those who don't, it's a little harder to gauge how much we perspire. Our bodies are constantly regulating our temperature through sweat. Even if you're on a computer or sitting in a chair, your body is still maintaining a healthy core temperature. You are constantly losing water throughout the day via breath, sweat, urine and bowel movements. So even mild dehydration can exhaust you and can affect many of your body's functions. And this affects us in the winter just as much as in the summer. Just because we're all wrapped up doesn't mean we don't need water. How much? So, how much should we be drinking every day? If you look at some of the university studies, they suggest between 8 to 16 8 ounce cups. For woman, woman, around 11 cups and for men, 16. So if you think of the 8 by 8 rule, is a good place to start. If you're exercising regularly, you'll need to drink more. One equation I know is to multiply your weight by two thirds and then look at your exercise level. Add about 12 ounces of water for every 30 minutes of exercise per day. Check your urine. A great way to tell if you're dehydrated is by checking the colour of your urine. The best time of the day to do this is in the morning. If it looks more like apple juice instead of water, has a strong smell to it, then you're definitely dehydrated. Another way is that if you need to urinate throughout the day, it's a good sign you are hydrated. Other causes of dehydration include diabetes, certain blood pressure and diuretic medications, extreme episodes of diarrhea and vomiting. And if you add a fever into the equation, you could be in trouble fast. During these times, increase your water intake quickly. The effects of this are memory loss more sensitivity to pain. It also reduces the cognitive and motor skills that you have and brings changes in your mood. If you start to feel these symptoms, grab a glass or two of water and sip it constantly. If there's any doubt, please consult your doctor as soon as possible. Now the benefits. The benefits of drinking water, which are soda free, to stay healthy are numerous. They include relieving fatigue, and this allows your body to function efficiently. Dehydration decreases alertness and concentration. Weight loss. New studies show that drinking a glass of water before eating leads to more weight loss. 
It flushes out the toxins and gets rid of waste through sweat and urine. It improves your mood and how you feel. Beats bad breath, regulates body temperature, helps with unhealthy skin and relieves fatigue. If you're going to succeed in a professional field or at school, you need to stay alert and knowledgeable throughout the day. Water helps expand blood vessels and supplies oxygen to the brain. If you stay hydrated, you can see your memory, energy and cognitive abilities improve. You can improve your physical agility, reaction time, be more awake, active and control of your day when you stay hydrated. And it's more than survival. Most of us know that we can survive without food for approximately a month, but we can only survive without water for roughly a week, more likely around four days. So let's fit more water into our day. Carry a reusable water bottle with you and keep it nearby. Be aware of how your body feels, and if you're not feeling so great, then you may need more water. Water really is one of the most important ingredients for health, growth and development. Now, my question for today is, how do you know you are getting enough water? Let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know what subjects you'd like me to cover in the next few weeks. Until next time, this is Jamie Brown, educating, inspiring people in wealth and wellness. Don't keep this a secret. Like, subscribe, share this with your friends and family. If we don't hedge our own future, our own health, for our own wealth, no one else is going to do it for you. And check out the links for my website below. Until next time, see you soon.